Hi everyone, it's Karen. I'm posting this short video to show you how to access the custom materials in Cricut Design Space. So to do that, you need to click the little icon in the top left corner here, the one with your name on it, and then choose Manage Custom Materials. I'm bringing this up because someone was asking about seeing which materials use a deep cut blade or creating materials using a deep cut blade. So when I look at the materials in my design space with my machine attached, when I go down further on the list, there are some that I've defined. Um, for example, this one, which is called acrylic. Um, and you can see here that it's using a deep cut blade. And I can go in to the material and edit by clicking the icon on the far right over here. I can change the number of times for multi-cut. I can change the cut pressure here. That would be by dragging this circle up or down and you can see the number changing right over here. So as I bring it back to the maximum, it will change back to 340. I can choose either a regular blade or a deep cut blade here. I'm going to put that back to deep cut blade. And then I can cancel my changes. Now I haven't changed anything. Let's say if I were to change something, then I can save it or I could cancel my change or I could delete the material. So I'm going to cancel the change and leave it exactly the way it was. All of the ones that are supplied with Design Space are regular, but let's say if you have something that you want to use a deep cut blade with, um, let's see, what am I going to find here? Let's choose leather medium. If you're finding that you would prefer to use a deep cut blade instead of using multi-cut, you could edit this item change it to deep cut and instead of having four multi cuts you could have two or none you would need to test the material to see how it's working for you you could save that and then use that as your material in the future you could also change the pressure there to add a little bit more pressure to help with that if you wanted to so i hope all of this has been helpful to you thanks so much for watching